this down. Oh, turn down the volume. Strain begins now. Should be live. Hello! Hey, we are live. People are here. Excellent. Excellent. Hello! Hi. It's going good. Good. The controls work. Everything is going according to plan. I'm doing okay! Uh, happy birthday. Yes, this is Jumping Flash. Jumping Flash. I'm a little out of it today. Uh, it's, it's been a long year. Uh, Ready to go? uh, the classic movie Megamind is great. I'm gonna change this aspect ratio. It's very, um, da -da -da. oh no, da 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 da. Uh, there we go. Now I can actually see things. I have not seen Netflix's Avatar. I want to see it, though. Yeah, this year's been, um, crazy. For, uh, many reasons. And I have not seen Squiddy at Box. I've just heard not good things about it. Uh, my favorite Pokemon movie is the third one. I think it's the third one. The one with the unknown and Entei. Hello, Coda. Uh, so, uh, how's it going? Um, exhausting. I'm still, I'm still recovering from everything that happened last month. Ah. Uh. Currently, Rebecca is still in hiding, as far as I can, uh, contend. Will you be reviewing more episodes of The Loud House? Uh, yes. Which shows are you the most excited to visit for C and Real? A lot of the classics that I haven't seen in forever. Uh, I really want to get back to Dexter's Laboratory. I remember liking that a lot. Uh, least excited? I would say problem solvers, but I've already done that one, most of it. Uh, so let's just say Secret Mountain Fort Awesome. Yeah. I have not seen Quiet on set. Because it costs money to see the movie. Yeah, we can go to the exit now. Which CN show am I on at the moment? Uh, Victor and Valentino. And that one is, like, surprisingly good. I'm surprised I never heard anything about it before the marathon. Burp, burp, burp. I, I can't give any news on the Rebecca stuff. Even if there was more to report, I gotta keep a lot of it confidential, you know? Uh, oops, not that. Uh, da, da, da. There we go. Uh, right. There we go. Da, 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 da. Oh, uh, there we go. Uh, thank you for the donation, and thank you for the donation. Did you take a break in between making the second video about Rebecca? Uh, no, I did not take any sort of break while making that. It was just go, 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 go with that. Uh, no cartoon show is worse than the Problem Solvers. Uh, at present, I think the Problem Solvers is the worst cartoon ever made. Like, seriously, no no joke or exaggeration. I believe it is that bad. Uh, 
yeah, I, I did hear Victor and Valentino was screwed over by the network. I do research on that stuff after I've seen the whole show. Uh, how's the Boss Baby review going? It's, it's been put on the back burner for a while because of everything. Uh, it's probably going to be the next major thing I try to get done. Uh, the first quarter of the year, I usually can't do any ambitious projects, because it is tax season. Yes, Problem Solvers is worse than Velma and Fairview. No, I don't really play Geometry Dash. I have played it. I just don't play it. Is Problem Solvers worse than anything you've seen or talked about so far? Yeah, pretty much. Ready to go? Like, uh, the bright seizure-inducing lights and color palette is what everyone brings up, but there there is no aspect of that show that is redeemable. Everything about that show is awful. Uh, yes, being self-employed makes taxes uh, a super pain in the ass. Uh, and super annoying. And, and yes, Problem Solvers is worse than Big Mouth and Current Family Guy. All right. If you don't believe me that Spongebob got bad again, just try watching it. I'm playing Jumping Flash because it's a game that I know that I can complete. What's worse, Samurai Jack Season 5 or Danny Phantom Season 3? Danny Phantom Season 3. Hello. Uh, thank you, probably sane. Problem Solvers is definitely worse than The Nut Shack. Then again, it's been forever since I've, I've seen the Nut Shack, but yeah, Problem Solvers is worse. Yeah, I don't always agree with my rankings on those lists, uh, especially the 2010s lately. Like, I, I've definitely reevaluated a lot of those shows. Not saying any of them are good, but I would definitely change up the ordering and some of the inclusions on them. What's a show or movie that you like that no one else did? Uh, I have no clue off the top of my head. <laughs> I mean, not check. I don't think is funny good either. But, uh, is Problem Solvers worse than Sanjay and Craig or uh, PPG 2016? Yes. <laughs> yes. I, I I don't understand these questions. I I said it was the worst. That means it's worse than at least everything I've seen. How's Wish and Last Airbender reviews going? Uh, right now I'm trying to figure out what next project to actually do. Like, after last month, I've got to try and, you know, get back on the saddle, which has been harder than I thought. Uh, thank you, Fiery Mashup, for the donation. Yeah. I've been in a mental funk for the past couple of weeks, to be honest. Do you remember that weird show that was on after Problem Solvers, Secret Mountain Fort Awesome? I've never seen that one. Uh, it seemed a little bit too similar to Problem Solvers, uh, but it will be on CN Real. Apparently, Ray, I don't know how to pronounce that, wrote a lot of stuff you hate. Ah, uh, that's, that's interesting, I guess. When are you reviewing Toy Story 5? I gotta review Toy Story 4 first. What do you think Quiet on Set will have? What effect? Uh, I don't think it'll have much effect on the network itself. Like, Nickelodeon's had this reputation for a long time now. Oh, yeah, this game doesn't have tank controls. Or, it does have tank controls, it doesn't have straight buttons. That's not good. Toy Story 5 does not exist yet. 
Do you have any thoughts on the Iron Giant? I love the Iron Giant. Not enough to have it looped for an entire 24 hours, but I really do like it. Uh, thank you for the donation. You sound like she did something off of Family Guy. Uh, I don't exactly know what you mean by that. I did not see Kung Fu Panda 4, unfortunately. I will have to eventually, though. Uncle Grandpa is pretty middle of the road. It's not the worst thing ever. It's just definitely not my thing. Come on, come on, come on. I have not yet seen Rock, Paper, Scissors. Uh, thank you uh, for the donation. Do you eat steak? Not often. Uh, and thank you for the donation. In High Guardian Spice Movie, you said that setting a head... I have not played the Dragon Age games. Uh, I want to. They've been on my backlog forever, though. Go, 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 go. I don't want to die. Go, 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 go. I hate this level. This level's annoying. Go, 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 go. There we go. Black Cauldron is not a very good movie. It has good aspects, but it is not a good movie. This is Jumping Flash, yes. This is Jumping Flash. Ready to go? Oh, this is the boss fight. Yes. This game's pretty easy. And it's really short, too. I think it was on the PS1... Uh, the uh, plug and play console. Ah, uh, damn it. Come on, die already. Die. Please die. Please die. Oh, I am just not on my game tonight. Yes, the PlayStation Classic. Thank you. That That's exactly what I'm talking about. Uh, I prefer a game that's too hard over one that's too easy. I think I put Captain N on the worst of the 80s list. Uh, the PlayStation Classic is probably the worst of the classic con uh, the classic release consoles. Because they made a lot of mistakes on it. Didn't even have Crash Bandicoot. <laughs> And now, we're in the amusement park world, yay! Yes, this is on an emulator. So, the goal of the game is to find four carrots in every level and get to the exit, basically. Yeah. This game came out in 1995. It wasn't a launch cons it wasn't a launch game for the console, but it was damn near close to it. I believe this is the first 3D platformer that was ever put on a console. Uh, this came out before Mario 64 even. Yeah. This game is definitely very easy. It was probably made with a young audience in mind. Uh, then again, it's very experimental. Uh, but it has a lot of charm. Uh, it definitely is fun, but you have to, uh, be able to deal with archaic controls. Uh, this game uses tank controls like Resident Evil. Uh, it does it a lot better than Rascal and Bubsy. Uh, but it's, it's still tank controls with no strafe buttons. Burp, burp. 
It's also very short. You can beat it in under an hour if you know what you're doing. And in one sitting. Maybe I'll play Rascal next time. Uh, thank you for the donation. My favorite Disney Channel show, both animated and live action. Uh, my favorite animated one is Phineas and Ferb. Favorite live action one is probably Phil of the Future. Uh, thank you, Lionheart. Uh, no news at the moment. Uh, Rebecca did, as far as we can tell, refund the crowdfunding campaign, but is also in hiding. Yeah. I have not seen uh, the the uh, blackout episode of Phineas and Ferb. Uh, Phineas and Ferb really grew on me as I watched more and more episodes. Ready to go? Yeah. What happened with Rebecca? Uh, you'll have to check out the big, huge video I made last month. Uh, I can't say much now, but uh, Star Giant Productions did some things. Thoughts on the Mega Mind Show? They have a show? I, I know they have a movie, but I didn't realize they made a show, too. Do you plan... I plan on remaking all of the Rebecca videos. I just gotta figure out how to do that without, you know, damaging the channel. Which is a, a challenge in and of itself. Thoughts on Rooster Teeth's demise? I haven't been into Rooster Teeth in forever, so I don't have many thoughts. Uh, floating whales! Who is smarter in Spongebob, Plankton or Sandy? Uh, Sandy, since her intelligence was flanderized. Have you watched Teen Titans The Judas Contract? Uh, no. I don't know what that is. Ah. Yes, I like Gravity Falls. I have not played Pseudo Regalia, no. I, I've definitely heard that the documentary is crazy. Yes, I have editors on my team. Anything we could do to help your mood? Uh. Give me time, I guess. Oh, that is the one with Terra. Okay. Like I said, I'm I'm not I'm not all on my game right now. Just just give me time. It'll probably take a while for me to be back on the saddle. I, I'm definitely trying to make good content this month. Obviously, it, it's my job. But I, I'm just gonna be a little bit out of it, you know. Uh, the next review is probably going to be Timmy's Secret Wish, because I've been holding off on that one for a long time. And Fairly Odd Parents seems simple enough to do, you know? Uh, which show did you watch you think deserves to be a cult classic? Uh, since I'm watching it right now, Victor and Valentino. I haven't seen all of it, obviously. I don't know how it gets, but, um... Uh, it's a lot better than the nothing I've heard about it. 
are you gonna do more stuff like the edit and edit video if it takes off and people like that kind of stuff and I can think of more ideas for that uh, which shows have you already finished for CN real I I can't name them off the top of my head. <laughs> I started with a few of the long ones, though, which is probably not the best strategy. Like, I obviously did Ed and Eddie, Ed, Ed and Eddie, and that's like a hundred episodes over five seasons and change, plus the movie, which it took me a lot longer than I care to admit to finish. Turning in this game is very slow. Have you seen any cartoons from Canada? Yes, I have seen Ed, Ed, and Eddie. Uh, and uh, Friendship is Magic. And the Total Drama cartoons. Hello. What caused you to cancel Nick Orama Season 2? Uh, the fact that this kind of thing needs to be done in... Uh, it needs to be a daily series to actually work. That much I know. Also, I kind of ran out of all of the big Nicktoons that everyone wanted to see episodes on. I know Pie Guy, not personally. There we go. This teacup's genie takes forever. Cartoon Network Real, are you planning on doing it? Yeah, I'm doing it in the background. There's the genie. Have you played any other Lego game? I played Lego Island and Lego Loco. And some construction Harry po Potter game that ran like dog turds back in the 90s. There we go. Yes, I am going to have to re-review Rise of the TMNT. There we go. All right. Yeah, Lego Creator Harry Potter. That that's the Lego game that I played. It ran like dog turds. What do you like the most about Stardew Valley? Everything about it, I think. I haven't seen Rise since my old re quote unquote review, so I'm not gonna comment on that. Will any see in real no, I will not do any of the live-action Cartoon Network shows, uh, because they would get the comments removed and they would fail instantly. Aaron Aloha. That, that's the villain of the game. Looks like he made a snowman. Ah. This is the ice level! Everyone loves the ice levels. Uh, thank you for the donation. Uh, it has been great to see you evolve and change over time. Would you please consider tackling the new adventures of Winnie the Pooh, Find Her Keeper? I will definitely give it a look. Uh, what is your favorite and least favorite song? Hmm. 
That's a good question. I know a lot of songs. Uh, okay, where are the other carrots? There's the other carrots. I hope the camera tilting down isn't too um, nauseating. Uh, this game is called Jumping Flash. It's a very early PS1 game. That's the exit. I have not heard of the cartoon O'Grady. Yeah, I play a lot of old games. All games that no one these days has ever even heard of. All games have a charm that a lot of modern games don't seem to have these days. Do you think Rick and Morty got any better? Uh, from what I've seen, it definitely seems to be getting out of the terror that was season five. Thoughts on the Oblongs? Uh, I remember watching it, and I remember being engaged by it, but I don't remember much else about it, beyond it being a very weird show. Okay, there's the exit. Do you put every single cartoon people suggest to you on your watch list? Uh, if enough people suggest it, uh, people know a lot of obscure stuff and stuff that I can't even find. Uh, if it's not too personal, what religion and culture did your family come from? Uh, I did go to a Catholic school growing up. Uh, we were semi-religious, not overly. Uh, and my family has a lot of Polish heritage. Okay, I have to stop and look around or I'm never gonna find this last carrot. Unless I already did find it. What's your least favorite show from this decade so far? Uh, Fairview. Fairview, I think, is the worst show I've seen from this particular decade. All right. Oh, I did find that last turret. Okay. Monday is going to be the solar eclipse, indeed. Have you seen the Total Drama reboot? <laughs> it depends which one you're talking about. It seems that show never ends. Is Kung Fu Panda 4 better than How, How to Train Your Dragon 4 doesn't exist? And it's likely not going to exist. I have not played the Toy Story 2 game, no. Go into the elevator.
this is the second corridor level, which is good because that means we don't have to play any more of them. The corridor levels in this game are bad. I have seen the Megamind 2 movie, and yeah, it's pretty bad. I don't think it's the worst thing that quote-unquote DreamWorks has ever put out. I still find Shark Tale worse. But it's pretty bad. Oh, yay, we got the power pill. I, I think it gives me invulnerability. Now we gotta find the, the other elevator, I think. Uh, Bro Town? I have never heard of that before. I'll have to check it out. Is this the right elevator? Uh, how have I been? Uh, I don't know how to answer that question these days. Yay, there we go. No getting lost this time. Good. Uh, no, I'll have to check out that trailer when I'm done with this. The Wild Robot. So basically, all of the bosses in the game, you, you just do this and you win. Uh, or not. Do you plan on reviewing Rango? Uh, I don't know about reviewing it. I've seen it and I really like it. I don't know if it would make a good review, though. Oh, no, I died. Okay, so you don't get hit if you just keep jumping. And jump on its back. What's your favorite Cartoon Network show? Uh, at present, it's Samurai Jack if we don't include Season 5. Cash in on 2010's Nostalgia? I hope so. Uh, when do I think? Uh, hopefully soon. Then I might be relevant again. Ah, uh, we're almost dead. Just... Gotta beat the turtle. Oh, there we go. All right. Would you do a video like how much the ads made again sometime soon? Uh, yeah, I could probably do something like that again soon if I could think of a good, you know, question. Uh, for a show that doesn't go on forever. Like, you could ask, how much money do The Simpsons currently have, but considering there's over 700 episodes, it, it, it's gonna take a while. Gummy bears or Swedish fish? I like Swedish fish. Ready to go? Yay, we're in the city world. Uh, this level is very sprawling. Did you like the Goosebumps TV show or books? I loved the Goosebumps books when I was a kid. How many wishes were made in the Fairly Odd Parents? Uh, too many. The 2016 version really did kind of take me out of uh, the Powerpuff Girls' favorite actor and actress. I don't know. Do 
you like Adult Swim? Uh, it's never been my preferred thing to watch. What cartoon had the most impact to the cartoon community? Uh, either Spongebob or Friendship is Magic. Uh, my favorite Michael Jackson song is Smooth Criminal. Free time. Yay, free time. Have you seen the Powerpuff Girls anime? No, I have not. Have there been any surprises while doing C and Real so far, for better or worse? Free time. Uh, problem Solvers is a hell of a lot worse than I remember, that's for sure. Uh, and also, actually, Long Live the Royals is actually surprisingly good for a four-episode miniseries that no one remembers or cares about. Is July your favorite month? Uh, sure. Where does Mau Mau land on C and Real? I uh, haven't done that one yet. Uh, the review for that one is coming out in December, though. Uh, I like the Mario movie. What are your thoughts on CW's live-action Powerpuff Girls reboot? I thought that was, uh, cancelled. Yeah. I have not seen The Room or Birdemic, no. What do you think about the American Tale movies? I've only seen the first one, and it was pretty good. Uh, it's definitely got a lot of 80s weirdness, though. Okay, that's the wrong direction. Uh, the CN Real videos will be uploaded in the order that the shows aired, yes. As for watching them, I'm going to be watching and writing reviews in whatever order I want. Thoughts on Don Bluth's Anastasia? I remember liking it. Uh, I liked Bartok more, though, I think. What game are you playing? This is Jumping Flash. One of the first 3D platformers ever made. Yay, okay, let's get to the exit before we die. Is this on PC? No, it's on PlayStation 1. All right. Press the start button. a series for one season that had full control, what would you pick and what would you do? That's, that's a good question. Uh, maybe Wayside. That show is just 
full of missed potential. Uh, yes, I have heard of the YouTuber Cartoon Shea, but I know nothing else about them. Uh, I assume that they usually review cartoons. Do you think Wish is worse than Chicken Little? Um, no. I am playing on BizHawk. I watched season one of Smiling Friends. I remember liking it. Never find the fourth in these city levels. Will you be talking about the Quiet on Set documentary uh, about Nick? Uh, I don't know if I have anything to add to that conversation, really. the exit. places, I guess. <laughs> Much of April is just going to be trying to get back on the saddle. <laughs> I have myopia. No, I do not have good eyesight. <coughs> this episode, uh, this game is quite short. Uh, we're almost at the end of it, actually. <coughs> yeah, I'm alright. Water just went down the wrong pipe. Yeah, I'm I'm fine. Don't don't worry about that. Just drink water a little wrong. <coughs> when will Gumball Season Seven come out? I have no idea. Chicken Little worse than Shark Tail. 
Uh, I think Shark Tale is the worst film, if I remember correctly. This thing just doesn't die, does it? Are there any 70s cartoons that you think are good? Uh, Schoolhouse Rock. Have you played the new South Park game, Snow Day? Uh, no, I haven't. I created this secret machine. Never underestimate the power of science. This is Jumping Flash. And this is The Last World. I played this game because I actually wanted to complete a game on these screens. And, uh, that was too far to jump. Okay. Let's... Uh, let's give that a go. Uh, this game is fun because you can just jump everywhere and, like, break physics completely. It's one of the few games that has a triple jump as a, a default. Scooby-Doo movie tier list. I don't want to watch all of the Scooby-Doo movies. Do you realize how many there are? <laughs> There's like uh, 30 of them. Play Tekken 3 a lot as a kid. Oh no, I don't want to go to the bonus. bonus. Alright, we're in the bonus. Let's, let's, let's pop the balloons. I don't need bonus stuff. Popping the balloons. Uh, yeah, I've seen Cat Icarus's uh, review on Cyber Chase. That one's a guilty pleasure for me. No, I have not played the Cosmic Shake. Sonic game. Uh, the only Sonic game I played to any length is Sonic Heroes. Nation. Uh, yes, they both do. It's strange coincidence. Streaming service that I use? I use Amazon Prime. There's one more to get somewhere. This mess. Did you know that Seth MacFarlane stopped writing on Family Guy after season 8 is probably why it went downhill? Uh, I have no idea. Ah, uh, there we go. There. Okay, 
Okay, let's get to the exit. Uh, this is the last of the uh, traditional levels. We only have two boss fights left, and then we're done. All right. And that'll be it for the live stream, so. Uh. Favorite Looney Tune shorts? I don't know, it's been a while since I've seen them. Ah. So now we must fight the evil clone of ourselves. Well, oh, it's not a clone, it's a robot. I saw myself in? Uh, I don't know off the top of my head. That's something I have to think about. Ah, it's jumping on my head. Is this game uh 1995 that's almost 30 years old i remember when nes games were 30 years old time moves too fast seen the eclipse Monday? Uh, yeah, sure. Come on, we gotta win here. There we go. All right. Favorite hero from DC and Marvel. Not too big on the on comic books. Yes, I played Qbert. It's not that fun. I prefer the original Powerpuff Girls. Uh, anyway, let's do this. Uh, final boss, the, the Baron Aloha. In this very psychedelic arena with very hard rock music. <laughs> Dark Robot fight is a little bit harder than this one. Uh, but this one isn't a slouch either. Yeah, it's 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 nineties weirdness. <laughs> Video games were just like this back in the day. Jump on his head. You 
you were an avatar, what bender would you be? Uh, the fire. Where'd he go? There, there he is. Now he looks like a head on an ice cream cone. Ow. I think I won! Yay, I did it! All right. That's the game, everybody! I win, I beat it under an hour. Yay! I'm done for now. <laughs> this game had a sequel. Might do that next time. I don't like it as much. Jumping flash. Oh yeah, there's also a super mode. Favorite character from Korra? It's been way too long since I've watched Korra. So, now that you beat the game, uh, you get the super mode, which... If I'm not mistaken... One, two, three, four... Five, six. You can uh, six jumps. <laughs> like you just, like it's crazy. You could just find a high point, find an even higher point. Oh, this castle here. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, it's a double, triple jump. Anyway, we don't we don't need to see this again. Uh, there was a jumping flash three, but it's a Japanese exclusive. Anyway, that's enough for now. I will see you guys next time. Uh, goodbye.